Hey guys, I'm gonna show you how to fix a leaky faucet. Leak, leak. <laughs> Um, it's usually uh, not a forced leak. No, it usually, it's leaks. been dripping for a while. In fact, it's been dripping for Four three years. and a half years. Four. Um, Maybe five. Ever since it was installed, and first thing you want to do is turn off the water below. All right, turn off water here and in here. But you also want to put a little stopper down here. You don't want anything to fall in there. Oh, so this is a Delta. Single handle faucet, one of these models. <laughs> I think it's the 19922 DST. Thus, it's circled. Yeah, 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 because I, I counted here and this is the one that matches ours, blah, blah, blah. Oh. Um, but Good. It, it, it'll work for probably any Delta faucet. Single handle. Yeah. Okay, so we want to get to the cartridge, which is in here. We take off this little thing here. Um, I don't know what you call that. A cap. Uh, yes. I'm gonna put it up here. Yeah. And then you need a an Allen wrench. It's a little dirty in there. Yeah, it is. And I'm pretty sure it's this number three. Uh, that would be three millimeter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. And I gotta unscrew it. Oh. Oh, that. nice. Yeah, yeah, you can move that. Yeah. Oops. <laughs> now a little tricky there. Dang it. Oh. There it is. Actually, it might be easier if I use this. Okay, oh, got yeah. that out, that little piece. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's the uh, screw. Yeah, very important. And this little handle comes off. Ooh. It would maybe, maybe zoom out a little bit. Oh. Yeah. All right. Is it gross in there? It's a little, little no, nasty. No, not bad. It's not, not that bad. <gasps> is that it? Well, this There's is the, the car. This is the cartridge. Oh, I turned off the water. Oh my God. Um, then you unscrew this cap. <laughs> For a second, I thought you wouldn't be able to do it. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, that's gross. We've got to clean that. Yeah. We might need to get some... Uh... Whoa. I uh, unscrewed... I took off more than I thought I was going to. <laughs> Maybe it just wasn't screwed down t tight enough. Maybe oh. that's the problem. All right. Because... This cap here actually unscrews. Okay. And then this usually usually takes a pair of here, zoom Swires out. On, to get, put, zoom I'm out seeing, on oh, zoom out. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Usually takes a pair of like pliers, adjustable adjustable wrench, if you will, to get that cap off. So I just unscrewed the whole thing. So, hmm. um, here's the, here's the, um, where does that go? See how, here's the new uh, one. Mm -hmm. Part number RP50587. Mm -hmm. Just in case you want to order it on Amazon, I'll put the link below. Um, but we bought this and this this goes right in here. Oops. Anyways. Now I'm wondering if I should try... Test it? Should, if I should try putting this back on. And tighten that? And tighten it and just see if that'll fix it Before or not. we open the $35 cartridge? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, $35 is better, more, better than $200. Yes, yes, for, for a new faucet. As you'll notice, there's two little... Um, uh, yeah, what do you call those pokey things? things? Pokey things. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then, so That's a but this makes term. it so you you easily just put it back in the Oops. right way. It fits in with those two little nubbins. Nubbins. I like that. Nubbins. You like um, that better than pokey things? No, pokey things. Oh, cause see in there, there's two little yeah. indents where you yeah. fit them in. Be careful okay. with the smoothness of your camera movement. Hey. Was it, wasn't that smooth? I don't know. Okay. Too jerky for you? Well, maybe for them, not for me. Oh. I'm not watching it. <laughs> All right. So, so here on top, I'll just show you, it has, um, this is the default for hot water. So if you, if your water's too hot, you can move this. And I'm thinking our water is sometimes is a, little a little hot. hot. <sighs> I can't even now get it. Okay. There. One over. 
Yeah, I'm wondering if... Let's try it. If it was never, like, even... All right. So, I kind of clean this off. We need to clean that off. Is that what you meant to say? I kind of just did clean oh, it off. Oh, with your fingies? Yeah. Okay. Not, like, serious clean. Yeah. So, if I was able to undo it, it just seems like maybe... So, I'm going to get the old channel lock... Um, wrench. Oops. I'm a pro. Yeah, you are. Am I gonna go even a little wider? Oh yeah. Get a better grip. Maybe. Hold this so it doesn't turn. Oops. I think it's tight. I think it's pretty tight. It just dripped a little. It did? But I, that's just water. Oh, but it's not even on. The water's not even on. <laughs> Ah, uh, see? Maybe that's too tight. Oh. Okay. That's... Alright. That's PDT. P Pretty darn tight. PDT. Okay. And then put this in here. We're going with. We'll have to clean that later. It looks a little grimy. Yeah. Or now we can clean it out. Yeah. We won't. So to test this, we don't need to assemble it True. completely. Right? This little thing. I mean, gotta get the plate there. We're just gonna try it here. Okay. Right. I, I'm not gonna follow you Please. under the sink. It's on. Now we wait for the drip. We might have to wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We might have fixed our problem. Three and a half years and... The light bulb. It's all over again. Uh, should I tell the light bulb story? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, oh, well, that's how you fix a, a <laughs> sink. Um, you may not even need to buy the part, but you can buy the part and then return it. Um, in this case, I think we're going to... Maybe, yeah, maybe if it's dripping, you do check that first. Yeah, but before you go buy the part. Yeah. So we're gonna mm -hmm. wait another week mm -hmm. and see if it needs replacing. Yeah. And for those of you who want to stick around for the story, oh. I'll tell you the story. But if you don't, you can leave. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so in our townhouse, 18 years ago or so, are you looking at? I am. I you? am. <laughs> I wasn't falling asleep or anything. No, okay. So no, I'm trying to tell my stories quicker, okay? I'll, I'll, so we moved into the house, and the person that sold us the house, um, they were like, uh, the, the front porch light doesn't work. And I'm like, okay, well, I'll get it fixed. No, the realtor said this, not that. The, I mean, we tested it, and it didn't work. And so we're like, <laughs> oh, we'll have to have someone look at that. Oh, wait. So we waited, I don't know how many years, three years, four years? I don't know. Let's not embarrass ourselves. Let's say it was two. I think it was more like two years. I think you're right. Um, it's still embarrassing. But um, so we finally was just like, we should try replacing the bulb before we asked someone. So we replaced before the bulb. Before we called the before electrician. Before we called an electrician, we did try, we replaced the bulb and it worked fine. So because they said it wasn't working. Um, no, I even think they said broken. Broken. It was broken. But really, it was just... The light bulb was. The light bulb, the filament was broken, and we needed to replace it. Mm -hmm. So it was pretty funny. We, this is another light bulb incident, it yep. looks like. Uh, seriously. If it I had... It hasn't dripped since we've been standing here. Yeah. And it was a pretty steady yeah. drip. Right, oh, well. well you know. Okay. That's how you do it. That's how you fix a leaky faucet. So... <laughs> Check to make sure it's securely in there. Yeah. All right. Cool. Cool beans. Bye.